Iranian television showed what it says was a successful test firing of short-range missiles. The show of force comes days after the U.S. warned Tehran over a newly revealed underground nuclear facility. The commander of the Revolutionary Guard Force also said Iran tested a multiple missile launcher for the first time. General Hossein Salami said Iran would test medium-range missiles Sunday night and long-range missiles Monday. The test came two days after the U.S. and its allies disclosed that Iran had been secretly developing a previously unknown underground uranium enrichment facility. The site in the arid mountains near the holy city of Qom is believed to be inside a heavily guarded underground facility. After the strong condemnation from the U.S. and its allies, Iran said Saturday it will allow U.N. nuclear inspectors to examine the site. Well, it is always welcome when uh, Iran uh, uh, makes a decision to comply with uh, the international uh, rules and regulations, and particularly with respect to the IAEA. By U.S. estimates, Iran is one to five years away from having a nuclear weapons capability. U.S. intelligence also believes that Iranian leaders have not yet made the decision to build a weapon. Iran also is developing a long-range ballistic missile that could carry a nuclear warhead, but the administration believes that effort has been slowed. Matt Friedman, The Associated Press.